make sure to hit that subscribe button, turn your notifications on, click that check mark, and hit save. I'm back! Good afternoon, guys. I know it's been a while. I have no explanation. Just haven't picked this camera up. We've been so busy and trying to enjoy the outdoors. As you guys know, we are in the middle of the summer. The girls. And in the middle of a pandemic. And in the middle of a pandemic. So we literally just been together 24 7, the girls, Trev and I, and just been doing a few things around the house, staying busy, keeping the girls busy. They are waving in the background. So let me walk over so they can say hi. Eaten. Chicken nuggets and fries are mm -hmm. over there. And we're drinking water. And why do we drink water, girls? And it's healthy. It's healthy, exactly. And my big muscles. Humongous. <laughs> Anyways, Trev is uh, here cleaning up. Hey, Trev. Hey. How you doing over there? Being worked, overworked, underpaid. You know, <laughs> overworked, underpaid in his own house. Sometimes that's just life, right? <laughs> Anyways, just got a delivery, guys. Super excited to share this with you. We are changing some of our decor, as we generally do. But this is something I've been really, really, really wanting to change for a while now. So, let me turn this light on because it's quite dark in this area. If you guys take in, like, my decor, it's a lot, I would say, like, more so, like, mid-century modern. Um, before it was very modern, but then we kind of changed it to mid-century modern. But then when we come into our living room area, we have these gray couches. And the gray couches don't work with everything else. Like if you look at this space, it just doesn't work. So we are getting our couches changed. This is a new company called Cose. They are here in Canada, out of Montreal. I'm really excited to be partnering with them because one, they are brand new. Two, I love how their pieces ship for you in a box and they are easy to assemble. So I'm gonna show you guys the assembly process the color we got is ivory, so I think it's going to flow a lot better with everything we have. And I think it's also going to brighten up the space. So stay tuned for the reveal. Just starting our setup. We have one piece out. So far, so easy. I was going to say so far, so far, so good, but so far, so easy. It is pretty self-explanatory. Um, there's like the bottom base piece, then the cushion that goes on top. You put the headrest in, and these are the cushions here. So we're just going through each box, but like already I can tell that I'm going to love the color with our current center table and also ruck. I'm so happy guys this is the two-seater setup it looks so much better in this space we're about to start the three-seater but one thing I did want to mention is the packaging job Trevon. well done honestly job well done. like even this just something as simple as this and you know what this was for guys for those that may not know like myself I mean I'm used to just grabbing a blade and slicing yeah when you slice, you actually protection. Piece of cardboard here to protect the so, material. So exactly, which is amazing. I really, really, little really details. love these little details. Even how it comes in these like duster bags duster, as well. Duster. Everything is so well packaged. It is such a simple process. You know what? It's so crazy. We actually started without the instructions, and then we found the instructions after. So fully prepared with instructions step-by-step step, teaching you exactly how to assemble it. So we're going to get started with a three-seater and hopefully be complete in probably less than 30 minutes. Sorry, I had to come back. Even little details like the handles, like look how well made these handles are for carrying. Honestly, I am incredibly impressed. And this is the final look. I am really, really pleased with it. The quality is incredible. It's 
comfy the installation was so easy as well and I think it really really brightens up the room I am gonna get some cushions and add some cushions to the space overall very very pleased so you guys need to check out cose.ca I will leave everything in the description this is absolutely incredible incredible quality and I am just so so happy with it so again check them out check out the description it's TD <laughs> it's been a while since y'all saw my face I know I know you guys miss me wait hold on let's let's be real about this y'all miss Samantha too because can we all admit we miss her vlogs she ain't been on the vlog tip so much anymore it's all right it's okay you know such is life there's really nothing to do we're still in quarantine and it is what it is so today the girls are with a bunny for my birthday they got a bunny they got a bunny Say, I got a bunny I got a bunny got I got a bunny I got a bunny I got a bunny Good afternoon guys. It is Sunday afternoon. I am so tired already. I don't even know what, what time is it, Trev? Uh, that's a very good it's question. probably like a little after 3. I just finished 3.45. 3.45. So almost 4 o'clock. I just finished washing the girl's hair and twisting it. Now Trev and I are on a mission to complete this little project here. We got a new grill from Broil King. We are going to assemble it and hopefully put it in the backyard. It is raining a little bit right now, so I'm just not too sure if we're gonna drag it in now or a little bit later. But we do have some accessories from them too. So I've partnered up with them to show this new grill. Well, new to us, but it has incredible reviews online. We also got an Imperial tool set we have a couple other accessories here that you guys can see really excited about this light as well so yeah I'm going to set this up and then we're going to get somebody to come in and install the yes. gas line so yes no more propane tank i'm so excited because let me tell y'all and i know you could feel me on this when you're like super hungry, you're barbecuing something, and then your propane. Then you, you hear that inevitable poof. Yeah, the poof noise, and your propane's done, and you can't even eat your food. It's so frustrating. So, this way, we will never run into that issue again. So, let's get to setting this up. I'm gonna show you guys a couple of the steps, and then obviously the final product. So, stay tuned. Have all the pieces out. Travis putting together the bottom portion of it so far so good pretty easy instructions are outlined pretty well so hopefully it doesn't take us that long i like that it has a little drawer here trev's just finishing up the base and we're going to put on the doors and then for the main attraction. Making progress. Nearly done. We are all done. I am so impressed. Like it's it just looks beautiful first and foremost and secondly too as we were installing it Trev was noticing a couple of features that it had that our old barbecue didn't we love the side burner here what's kind of cool about this is you can move it up to sear so like you can lift this piece up sorry it's hard to do with one hand and you put it up when you're searing and then to store it you just put it back down in that same section so that way it can close this goes up to 1700 degrees fahrenheit for searing so this is like perfect if you have a steak that you want to sear at the end of its cooking process and it locks in the heat for amazing results too so i really really like this and then you can obviously close this section down and then i mean look at this guys one the knobs are incredible they also do light up too i believe you just press this button and they light up which is awesome and then when you open it up 
this is the main attraction. We do also have the rotisserie. We haven't set it up yet, but um, we are going to do that as well. But this is amazing. It's one, two, three, four, five burners. Our old one, I believe, had four. So there's a lot more space here. Then we move over to this side, and then I love this because it kind of gives you a little breakdown of the warranty. There's a 10-year limited warranty. It also goes into details about the heating process, etc. So again, I'm going to link this grill below. We are going to have so much fun because it's summertime and we're always barbecuing. We're gonna create a couple of awesome recipes and share them with you guys. So stay tuned for that. But yeah, we're going to get somebody to come and install the line, as I mentioned, and then set this up in our backyard. I am so tired. Hi. I am just exhausted. Hi, Zai. Hi. <laughs> they have a twist. Who did those beautiful twists for you? Mommy and Daddy. Mommy and Daddy? Daddy didn't do your hair? Only, yeah, no. Only so just feeding. Trev helped with <laughs> washing the hair. And Daddy put conditioner in. Yes, he put conditioner in. But girl, Mommy <laughs> did those twists. Hi. Talk normal, silly Billy. So what are you up to? What are you guys up to? Zai, let's go play that game again. Anyways, um... I don't know if I told you guys that Zara, ever since she was born, she had like a reflux issue. And then as she got older, it never kind of stopped. And she's like four years old now. And she never stopped. After she eats, she always brings up stuff and throws up. So on Tuesday, we have an appointment with her at Sick Kids Hospital. I am very, very nervous just because hopefully fingers crossed we discover what is making her throw up so often um but you know the, the unknown is just always scary but I'm, I'm hoping we come to the bottom of it so she's doing something called i think it's a barium swallow barra barra something i have it written down on my phone and of course i dropped my phone but um yeah i don't know how long she's gonna be there for and because of covid we're not obviously going as a family trev is gonna go and um take her and i'm gonna stay home with zaya so yeah i'm a little bit um nervous about that so guys just uh, pray sad. for me pardon me a little bit sad or pray for her i should say i'm not sad i'm not sad um so yeah that's basically what's going on we've been working on so many projects around the house um, I didn't even get to show you guys the deck like we changed up some stuff on our deck too Which it's become our little oasis like with COVID. We're just trying to make a little our little backyard a little more appealing and Just inviting and something that we look forward to going and relaxing in almost every day So yeah, I will share that with you guys on the next vlog But um, I mean the next, the next challenge The next challenge what challenge they've been watching my videos religiously all, all of day. my vlogs all day i'm not joking yeah. they start talking like me using my verbatim they've watched every single vlog they get up in the morning and all they want to do is watch mummy's vlogs so i have to ensure that my content is children appropriate because girl they've been saying some stuff and i'm like where'd you hear that from and then i'm like oh yeah you probably heard it from me <laughs> Anyways, guys, I am going to end this vlog here. So thank you guys so much for watching. And I'll see you guys on my next video. Say bye. bye.